Now to a devastating wrong-way car crash in Southern California that injured, injured 25 Sheriff's Academy recruits on a training jog. A 22-year-old driver passed the breathalyzer test after plowing into them on Wednesday in South Whittier, about 18 miles southeast of Los Angeles. He is now in custody with minor injuries. According to the L.A. County Sheriff, evidence suggests that he accelerated and did not try to stop. Alex Capriello is here with the latest on that story. Good morning, Alex. Mitch, good morning to you. This new surveillance video shows all 75 of these law enforcement recruits running in formation. Now, a word of warning, this video is a bit difficult to watch as you see this speeding car drive directly toward the front of the pack with no signs of slowing down. This morning, around two dozen law enforcement recruits remain hospitalized after a car plowed into them unsuspectingly during an early morning jog. Five of those recruits are said to be in critical condition with injuries ranging from head trauma to loss of limbs. We're freezing the surveillance video at the moment of impact since it's graphic. The collision occurred just after 6 a.m. Wednesday. A group of 75 men and women from various law enforcement agencies were running in formation when a wrong way driver veered into them head on. Recruits reported hearing the car accelerating. Lanes unidentified didn't have any alcohol in his system, but reportedly told investigators that he was feeling sleepy. L.A. County Sheriff Alex Villanueva likened the unfolding chaos to an airplane crash. There were so many bodies scattered everywhere in different states of injury that it was a uh... Pretty traumatic for all individuals involved. Family members and loved ones were air flighted to nearby hospitals to be with the patients in the most critical condition. Others dropped flowers at the scene and shared what they've learned. Then try to help other people around him as he was able to do. These law enforcement recruits have been spread out to various hospitals here across the greater Los Angeles area. One of those recruits is said to be on a life saving ventilator at this point. The Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department is welcome in opening uh, donations from the public to help out with these medical expenses. Mitch? That's a terrible story, Alex, but we thank you for that report. Yeah. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.